welcome to my channel. Today's video is going to be a product review on a bunch of new stuff from Chi. Um, so I don't know, I'm sure all of you guys are familiar with Chi. It's like the hair care brand. <laughs> Number one, like, I don't know, it's just the most well-known one, I think. I think they're kind of like the first people that had like popular flat irons and you know, at least for me, when I think of Chi, I think of amazing flat irons. My first flat iron ever was a Chi and I absolutely loved it. Um, it burnt out after many, many years of use and I kind of never went back to it because I'm, if you guys know me and know my channel, basically I just like to try new things and see what's the best out there and I heard GHD flat irons were the best and whatnot. So I decided to give them a try and um, even though I wasn't like overly impressed with GHD, after my GHD burnt out, I went on to something else and I never kind of went back to a Chi even though like looking back, it probably was the best flat iron I ever had. So that's how I know the company. Um, I was actually contacted by their PR company and I was told about a new product launch that they had, an entire line which was all sent to me which is super generous. Um, as well as something targeted specifically for blonde hair. So I got all these products sent to me. I'm not being paid to review them. Um, she's very comfortable with me giving my honest review and I have taken quite some time to put my review together. Um, mostly for the fact that if you guys have watched my other videos, um, you can you can see too. Just by looking at my hair, I got it lightened um, recently and it really, really damaged my hair. Like, it doesn't look it. I can do a really good job blow drying it and whatnot because I am pretty knowledgeable when it comes to my hair. Um, but when um, it's like first being blow dried, all the ends are so frizzy and dead and just like, it's a disaster. So I want to give these products a really fair shot. I only started using them maybe a week before my hair was done. So I have, you know, some knowledge before damaged hair as well as with damaged hair. But, um, you know, clearly products can't really fix damage like this. Like the only thing that can fix it is time, haircuts, and you can add moisture with products, but it's only like a temporary fix. So keep that in mind. Um, but I really want to give these a good shot. Like I've now used them for three weeks with this damaged hair. So I can really tell you whether I like them or don't like them. So with all of that said, <laughs> let's get into it. And I'm going to share this line with you. It is the Chi Rose Hip Oil line and it's their color nurture line. So everything is good for color treated hair and it smells like amazing. Like <laughs> It's called rosehip oil, so when they're sending it to me, she was saying it smelled really good. And I kind of imagined, obviously that would smell like roses, but I figured since it's rosehip oil, it probably isn't, like roses is probably just a really nice like fragrance that, you know, is maybe like floral or something. Um, but no, it actually is exactly as it states. It is like a true rose scent, which I love. It reminds me um, of the, I think, I don't even know what it's called. It was a bath, or not a bath, Body Works. Um, it was a body shop uh, spray and I still have it. It's super old. It's actually like embarrassing. I should throw it out, but I just love the smell of it and it smells exactly like these hair products. So it's great. Um, a lot of them linger after you use them and it's just like amazing. So I'm going to go through and share with you the products that I got from her in that line as well as the stuff. Well, she only got one product, but this is their new color illuminate conditioner. And I got the platinum blonde one, which is supposed to really brighten up your blonde and keep it looking good. So I'll review this as well at the end. But yeah, let's get into it. I'm gonna start off with the shampoo and conditioner. The first things I tried were the shampoo and conditioner. I just got these little pumps. These are the 340 milliliter size. Um, and to be quite honest with you, I did not really use the conditioner. And the reason why I didn't use the conditioner is because, uh, well, actually I actually used it once, but it was nothing like special because I don't really, like I don't use conditioners. So I'm not a good judge of a decent conditioner whatsoever, but I am a really good judge of like deep repairing conditioners, which this one is. So these are the two products I use in conjunction with each other in the shower. And I, I gotta tell you, I absolutely love this shampoo. It smells like the roses really, really nicely. It's so, so good. Um, I've used quite a bit actually, since I only wash my hair like once or twice a week. Um, so, you know, I've actually used quite a bit for the amount of times I've washed my hair with this and I absolutely love it. The scent is to die for. It is so, so good. I feel like my hair is really, really clean when I use this. It doesn't leave any like residue behind. Um, I'm very picky with shampoos. A lot of them, if they're supposed to be moisturizing or like good for color treated hair, I find that sometimes that you leave a little bit too much moisture or like they kind of have a film. They leave a film over your hair. That's kind of what I found in the past. Like you kind of like it feels different. It doesn't feel like your hair, there's like something kind of over it. And this shampoo doesn't do that. It just really gives your hair a good clean. And I'm sure it does moisturize. Again, like I'm mostly leaving that to my deep conditioner. So I don't really know all that much about how much this moisturizes, but I really like this shampoo. As a shampoo, as something that washes your hair really well and smells good, this is like amazing. So I really like this and I definitely will be repurchasing it when I finish it. 
I just really, really like it. I don't know. <laughs> so the next product is the deep conditioner, which is actually called the Color Nurture Recovery Treatment. And this stuff is really, really good. I like this as well. Um, basically what I do with this is I will take my hair after I wash it, squeeze out all the excess water, apply a thick, generous coat of this, like a lot of this stuff. And I'll, I'll put it from roots to tip because my hair is so damaged. It doesn't make a difference. It doesn't make my hair oily or anything like that. Um, it just works really well. So I'll take this, I'll apply it all over my hair and I'll leave it on for like as long as I can. Most of the time, maybe around four or five minutes. And then I'll rinse it out. And this stuff leaves a total film over top of your hair. I'm gonna say that right now. Um, I don't know how, it, like, I don't think it's worked that all that great for my super damaged hair, but I can tell you before coloring it, this stuff was really good. Like it really brought my hair to life. I feel like it gave it a really good amount of moisture and all of that. But ever since my hair has been damaged, I don't find that this does any better than any other conditioner. But again, my hair is like so damaged and so far gone that, you know, I don't think any products are really going to make a difference. But I was shocked to see that like my hair was so bad that this didn't work as well as it did beforehand. But before I, and my hair is always kind of damaged because it's blonde before it was extremely damaged like it is right now this stuff worked great so i definitely recommend this if you're looking for a deep conditioner this stuff is really good um it's sulfate and paraben free which is the same i think with most of their products if not all of them i know the shampoo is um and the shampoo actually really sets up nicely which is great for a sulfate free conditioner that's pretty rare um but this works really great so i don't know i like it would i purchase this over the one i've been purchasing for the last couple years no, I don't think I would because I do have a deep conditioner I really love and I feel like does make a slight difference on my super damaged hair, but this isn't anything that's bad. It's just not my favorite. The next three products are all, um, they're styling products for this line. So the first one is the Color Nurture Repair and Shine Leave-In Tonic. Basically when I get out of the shower, I just spritz this all over my hair before I blow dry it and it smells amazing. I'm sure it is, it is repairing my hair, but again, I haven't been using it long enough. One month isn't really enough to see a huge difference with a product like this, but so far I really like it. The smell of it is amazing. It smells like that, that rose scent that I was telling you guys about. I just, I don't know. I love it and I feel like the more I layer the scent in my hair, the more it kind of like lasts and I can like smell it throughout the day. Like I can smell it on my hair right now and I just love it. So love this stuff. It's it's good so far as far as I can The next tell. product is the Color Nurture Dry UV Protecting Oil. And this is something that I spray on my hair when I'm completely done styling it. When I'm done blow drying it, straightening it, whatnot, um, I'll apply a generous um, layer of this all over my hair, kind of like you would a hairspray. And then I just kind of like play with my hair a little bit just to make sure it's all kind of soaked in. And this is supposed to add shine, it's supposed to be weightless, and it's supposed to have UV protection from the sun and kind of like help keep your hair color, whatever it might be, looking vibrant and fresh and not faded. So this is gonna be something that I find a lot of use in in the um, summer months, I'm sure. But so far I've really been liking it. It does add a little bit of shine, makes my hair have a little bit more life to it now that it's like so damaged. But again, this has that amazing smell, so I, you know, you can't go wrong spraying this in your hair. And the last product from the Rosehip Oil line is this one. It is their Color Nurture Dry Shampoo. And I have to tell you, out of all of these things, this is probably my favorite. And why I love it so much is I feel like there's no products that I've tried anyway um, that are comparable to this. I have so many dry shampoos and I've tried so many over the years. And when you spray them in your hair, your hair always feels so wet. And not, not that it doesn't just like fade away, but it feels wet and it's just a, a totally different consistency than this is. When I spray this in, it is just like a very light, fine mist and it really does a good job at perking your hair up and making it look freshly washed, but it doesn't have that like weird wetness that all the other ones have. So I don't know if that's why this works so well, but I just love it. And the scent, this is gotta be out of all of the products, the scent that lingers the most. Like I find if you don't even use any of that other stuff, this alone will give your hair such a beautiful scent. So I love that. It's like perfume for your hair. You're also at the same time dry shampooing. So yeah, I'd have to say that this is definitely my favorite product out of everything in the line. If you're going to try anything, I would definitely highly recommend the dry shampoo. Um, as I said, it is a very dry consistency, which is amazing. And I feel like all dry shampoo should be like that. But also, like before I got my hair colored, I had some really thick roots going on. And I sprayed this on my dark roots and it did not leave a white cast at all. No extra like leftovers, you know. Some dry shampoos just leave like a lot of stuff in your hair. My hair just felt clean and beautiful and it smelled amazing. So this is definitely something I'd look into if you're looking for a dry shampoo. And even if you're not, because this is like a perfume for your hair. It is so, so nice. So this is definitely my favorite. 
Um, along with that, I also really, really like the shampoo. The shampoo is something I will be repurchasing as well because I do think it's a really good cleaning shampoo and it smells amazing. And also the other two styling products, I have to say that so far I really like them. Again, I'll update you guys with favorites videos whether I see a significant difference using either of these. Like I feel like the UV one, the UV protecting oil, will really be tested in the summer months when like all the UV rays are coming down your head, you're outside by the lake, by the pool. Um, I feel like this will really be tested to show if it really does improve my hair's color and the longevity that I get out of like my hair looking fresh and good. But so far, so good. Um, it's been like three weeks, I think, since I got my hair done. And I feel like it's just as fresh of a blonde, so definitely like that. And then the Repair and Shine Leave-In Tonic. Again, this smells really nice, and I hope it's working really well. Um, again, it's hard to tell. It's not really fair to this product because my hair is so, so damaged. But I'm spraying it on continuously, like, every time I do it, and I'll update you guys if anything changes. But so far, I really like this as well. So now on to the other product line, which is the Color Illuminate Conditioner. And I got it in the Platinum Blonde, which is for cool blondes. And it's supposed to be a color-enhancing conditioner. And I have to say, I am such a fan of purple shampoos and purple conditioners. I feel like it really makes a difference on my hair. We live out in the country, so the water is somewhat hard. And I feel like using a purple shampoo or purple conditioner makes a huge, huge difference. So I can tell you right away if something is a crappy conditioner or a good conditioner just because, you know, sometimes they don't even work with my water. This worked amazing. I am really, really pleased with it. I bought one from L'Oreal that I got from my stylist and it was the first ever blonde conditioner I've ever used. And it left me very disappointed. I didn't feel like it made a difference. Like just no pros or anything. I threw this on my hair and I've got to tell you, my hair was so vibrant and bright and I actually tried this right before I went to the salon for the first, first time and it actually made a difference on my dull, like three month old colored hair. So that tells you something, clearly it's working quite well. So I never really use this on its own, I always mix it with another conditioner, like a deep conditioner, which is what my stylist told me to do with all blonde um, conditioning products. Just kind of mix them with some other things to really like get the most um, you know, out of your time in the shower because you're not going to leave on like a deep conditioner for five minutes and then this for five minutes. Realistically, you're not going to leave it on long enough. So I like to mix the two and put them on my hair and it really, really helped to illuminate the color. Like I am really impressed. Yeah, it's something I'll definitely be repurchasing for years to come. It works really, really well. And I'd have to say it works way better than the L'Oreal Professional one. I think it's called the CC Cream or something like that. Um, it's in like a pink bottle and it's the same idea. You get way less, it's way more money <laughs> and it doesn't work at all. And this works amazing. So this is something I definitely recommend if you have color hair, they have a bunch of different ones. They have different blondes, they have redhead stuff. They have things for people with brown hair or black hair, gray, like they literally have it all. So definitely check it out if it's something that you are interested in. It's perfect for anybody with colored hair that really wants to get it vibrant. Or if you just have like white hair that you want to like bring to life, you know, you just want to kind of like bring the good tones out of it, cancel out all the yellow and the like ashiness and the um, like anything that's like brassy basically. This stuff is great. So I definitely recommend this. I was really blown away by all the stuff I got to try. Um, this stuff is great as well as all the stuff from the rosehip oil line, um, you know, the, cu the couple ones that I showed you that were really stand up products. Um, I'm really happy that I got a chance to try them out. I got to see Chi as a brand outside of their hair, hair straighteners and all that stuff. And I've got to say, I am quite impressed. Overall, you know, actually going through an entire product line, that is pretty great that some of these products have replaced things that I was currently using. So I love them. I hope you guys get the chance to check them out. I hope you enjoyed my review on these products. I hope you, um, you know, found them helpful in choosing the types of products you might be looking for. But yeah, thank you so much for watching. And until next time, we'll see you then. Bye guys. If I could be